Is it commendable to sacrifice the needs of the few in favor of the needs of the many? Good morning. I want to share with you an excerpt of a letter of the Rebbe where the Rebbe addresses someone who was instrumental in creating the electrical system in the Chabad village in Israel, Kfar Chabad. And after the Rebbe thanks him and points out the divine providence of the first usage of the electricity for a Hasidic gathering, he says that a Hasidic gathering illuminated by the light of electricity is emblematic about what Hasidut is all about because electricity is a hidden force in nature in the sense that we can't access it with our five senses, and yet it illuminates the darkness. And so too, Hasidut is something that is a hidden part of the Torah, and yet it illuminates the darkness of ourselves and, and the world. And afterwards, the Rebbe says to him, I want to ask you for your assistance in helping an individual, but before I do, I want to talk about the fundamental principle in Judaism about the, the importance of the individual. Unlike other opinions who say that it is, a, it is commendable to sacrifice the individual for the benefit of the community, our sages taught us that anyone who saves one person is tantamount to saving the entire world. And there are many other teachings of our sages that echo this principle. In addition to this, in every person there are hidden strengths, and it's possible that one day this person can be someone who has influence on the community as well. And at this opportunity, I want to draw your attention to the need of one individual, although certainly you'll do whatever you can to help this person anyways, but our sages tell us to encourage the energetic. I dedicate a minute of Torah today to the neshama of Leora Bat Rachamim. May your neshama have an aliyah, may she be good to better on behalf of her family for all good, b'seich chal Yisrael. Also dedicate this to Yosef Jacobo in honor of his birthday today for a year of bracha v'atzlacha b'gash misavaruchnis. Have a wonderful day.